morning you guys so as you can see i just showered and now i'm gonna get ready today i decided to show you my five minute natural makeup because i'm just going to work and i don't want to look too crazy and too fancy so the first thing i'm gonna do is i'm gonna use a little bit of vitamin c um, so I use this vitamin C and retinol, retinol in the evening, vitamin C in the morning um, and I will show you the process of it in a next video because it's quite interesting what happened to my face after using it and I mix it with this Aven, this is Aven, I don't know if it's focused or not but anyway it's a, it's a cream with SPF which is supposed to moisturize my face for the whole day so I'm gonna apply this on my face and of course the neck as well and then I'm gonna use a little bit of under eye cream this one is from Rezibo I told you many times about how much I love this brand okay so now I'm settled and let's move on to the makeup the first thing obviously I'm gonna use foundation I know that for natural makeup you shouldn't use it but this thing here needs a little bit of foundation, okay? I'm not gonna use a lot. I'm using the Bourjois Healthy Mix foundation, maybe two pumps, and I'm not even gonna apply it with a beauty blender. I'm just gonna tap it around my face, because as I said, it's not a lot. It's just to cover a little bit of my imperfection. All right, okay, so now the most important part, which is concealer i haven't been using concealer for a long time but now i realized that i do much need it <laughs> since maybe a year or two i realized that i have a dark patches around my eyes so a little bit of concealer is needed and now let's move on to my eyes and my eyebrows so the first thing, I'm just going to use a little bit of this shiny eyeshadow. I'm not going to use a lot of this, but just to add some like glittery and awakeness to my eyes. So I'm just going to put a little bit of this on my eyelids. That's basically it. <laughs> and then I'm going to use the highlighter from Makeup Forever. I have this literally forever, <laughs> like I would say for three years. I don't even know is it out of date or not, but it's still working, so I'm using it. So I'm just going to use it on my cheekbones, in inner corners. Now I'm going to use a little bit of bronzer. Next step is my eyebrows. So I naturally have very thick eyebrows, so I don't feel like I have to do a lot of things with them. But I'm just gonna put a little bit of the, the thing. It's like an eyeshadow for eyebrows. I don't know what's the name of it. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of that. And that's basically it. I'm not doing much with my eyebrows, honestly, guys. Well, besides the fact that I have to take them out like once in the two weeks and it's very painful and I think this is enough like I don't want to do more and, and since I'm not using any um, lipstick today I will just use a little bit of concealer on my lips then mascara all right and as a last step, this is optional, but I have a little bit of an oily skin, so I will use a little bit of powder, but I'm not going to tap it everywhere, I'm just going to use it on the section that I'm shining the most, which is my T-section. And that's it. My makeup is done. This is the really natural and usual makeup I'm doing every single day. It's so easy, so simple, and I love it. Okay, thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, don't forget to leave the likes, subscribe my channel, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!